can save you from me. Greetings, mortal. I knew you would find your way back here. The bow rumored that not only is good for the stats that it has, but with its aura makes it a top tier weapon for most bows on players that want to focus on physical damage aside from elemental, primarily using multi-shot, guided arrow, and possibly strafe as the main skills. This bow specific rumor comes with a hefty cost of an own rune and a jaw rune, but for the benefits that it could give both to your character build and your mercenary, it's seen as worth it for so many. This rumor has the potential to roll either amazingly or as hot garbage, and there are two varying stats to focus on for how it rolls. It has a chance to roll with one or two to all skills, and the Fanaticism Aura ranges from level 12 to level 15. And while the Fanaticism Aura damage output would have a higher varying output, the attack speed difference between the high and the low roll wouldn't be as significant. Now that the Aquan Mercenaries can use Amazon specific bows, this is what many are going to be wanting to roll this room word in, especially for the potential addition to plus the bow and crossbow skills that the bow bases would have. Otherwise rolling this in a great bow if you want to be traditional because it's what the fastest bow a Merc could be able to use before patch 2.4. But if using an Amazon specific bow, this could potentially have the room would roll plus two to all skills with plus three to bow and crossbow skills at its very best versus using a non-Amazon specific bow and potentially only rolling plus one to all skills, breaking the rumor regardless of how the fanaticism roll. Additionally, the static 330% enhanced damage, ignore target's defense for regular non-boss and champion enemy, 300% bonus to attack rating, damage to the undead, and some help with your resistances is another set of great selling points for why you should roll this rumor for your bow is on. However, where this bolt is amazing and has a minor drawback is the Fanaticism Aura, which gives a boost to damage, attack speed, and attack rating. This is great for the one wielding the weapon as they get the full benefit of the aura. However, for other party members, they receive a percentage of the effect, meaning if you give this to your mercenary, it helps them to deal more damage and the Aquan mercenary, despite being given a slight buff in the latest patch, still are not as strong as the long-standing king of mercenaries, the Act 2 desert mercenary, or the now fighting for the top spot Act 5 mercenary. With them having the rumored, your character and any other party members would get a percent of the aura's effect. And for most, that could be more than fine as all they would need on their character is attack speed, but wanting to actually buff up the mercenary. But for those wanting to use this rumored on their character, this is better paired with pride with the Act 2 mercenary for the additional boost to physical damage.